Hello fans, welcome to the Media Motivator, welcome to the crypto space. In this video, I will be talking about scam cryptocurrencies, scam tokens, legitimate tokens. I will also be showing you how to avoid scam cryptocurrencies and I will actually focus on a few or let's say two Meme coins. The first one is Tuzuki Inu. Tuzuki Inu is a meme token that has been existing for over six weeks. This token has performed so well in the last six weeks, but surprisingly, they scammed yesterday. If you look here, you'll be seeing uh, and a percentage of 42.7. Uh, within the last four hours, as an increase of 42.7 in the last in the last 24 hours, uh, which is somehow deceptive. Uh, this is actually deceptive in the sense that yesterday the developers of this token pulled out, they withdrew very huge amount, and the percentage dropped to over 98 percent i mean 98 percent you can imagine your funds your capital reducing by 98 percent and it stayed around 98 97 for over five hours and so a few newbies maybe they discovered that the value has dropped and they thought it was going to rise again they started pumping back they started buying and yesterday evening uh, it, it went up again to close to 400 percent due to the influence of newbies and so this morning again they've started pulling back as just in this video i think when i started it was above this you, are, you can now see where we are already i'm sure by the end of this video we will be in the neighborhood of 35 so this token has actually scammed i mean it has actually scammed i was a holder of some of the, the tokens and as we speak, I'm almost at zero, at zero dollar. I'm almost at zero dollar because they pull out almost everything. This token was actually listed on one of my uh, favorite uh, uh, exchange. Favorite in the sense that they list so many coins, not in terms of its quality. They, 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 are con they constantly list coins. Within the week, they can list about three, four coins, which is not so common with other uh, exchanges and this exchange is no other exchange but L Bank. I'm going to take you to my L Bank account, to show you how they actually uh, unlist this token there. That those who have this token in L Bank they can no longer exchange it, they can no longer sell it, they can no longer use it in any way. It has been unlisted without any notification without any print notification so this token as i said earlier has been scammed and the next one on the list i'm suspecting so strongly with some uh, uh, degree of evidence though not 100 percent you need to do your own research when i look at saitama you know which is also a meme coin i am very very afraid that they might do the same thing like uh, Suzuki Inu. You know, remember these two they came up almost at the same time and they had almost the same performance you can actually see from here you see the evolution I'm on coin market cap the evolution of Suzuki Inu. You know, the, 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 the the left from almost nothing they got to the apex here and then they pull out they pull out and you can imagine what uh, those who actually invested on this token are going through you can see it is terrible you see you see this you can see that is there uh, i think that's the three uh, now let me take a one month time frame for you to see very well this one month time frame this come somewhere around here people pumped in again money they pull out everything so i am actually on a coin market cap and again, as I've always mentioned in my previous video, before you invest on any token, especially the Meme token, 
make sure you run a few tests on there on the token i have made a video using the coin uh, sniffer approach uh, or method which makes use of artificial intelligence in investigating but there are other ways of investigating go straight to coin market cap as i have done click on that coin you will be taken to this page you can actually from here the first thing you invest you, you verify the number of holders here they have about seventeen thousand holders which is not bad yes which is not bad but from there move right down here where you see holders again you want to see how much each holder is having you can see when you click on that section you scroll the pitch if you are using a mobile phone you scroll the pitch a little bit up you will see rank you see the rank you see the address scroll the page to the left you see the quantity each account is holding each address is holding and then you look at the percentages you can see percentages here 11 percent 10 percent 9 percent 2 percent 1 1.6 1.1 1.02 1 1 and you see when you see a coin with a few addresses that are not actually uh, the address of some exchanges holding a very huge amount you need to run away from such a token remember before this come there were a good number of of ad ad addresses here that were holding very huge amount so they've pulled out and that is why the price has dropped they have dumped it on uh, small holders so always run this check you verify how much each address is holding if you see any address if you see a coin that so many addresses that are not actually owned by exchanges having very huge amount run away from that coin because by the time they start pulling out that coin is going to dump and that is exactly what these guys did you can see the first three here are actually owned by exchange i'm sure this other person here these other ones they'll be pulling out any of these days and you will see the price will go down very fast for the for the ones up here but always verify very well to know to see if they are actually owned by exchanges or they are actually burns account like the first one here is a burnt account this i think these two are exchanges this Uniswap is an exchange. I actually bought through Uniswap. This Bitmart too, I'm sure it's also an exchange. But this one is a burnt account. So these ones, don't bother so much about these ones. Any other accounts, any other address that is down here with a very huge percentage. Anything above 1%, anything above 1% should be a call for concern. So you need to actually take note of that. You take note of that before you actually go into buying and holding that coins and before i continue if you are a holder if a newbie and you want to actually hold successfully go to the description of this uh, video join our telegram group i and my team have done carry out investigations on a good number of tokens and we have listed about 15 good coins and tokens that you can hold with a lot of confidence join the telegram group which is free you will not pay anything all you need to do is to subscribe to our channel like our videos share them and hit the notification bell and most of the tokens we have uh, listed are owned by exchanges by cryptocurrency exchanges so in the description of this video I'm going to leave another link that will help you to be able to differentiate between a cryptocurrency that will scam in the nearest future and a legitimate cryptocurrency. Make sure you watch that video. Make sure you share the video so as to prevent newbies from being scammed. Share the video, please. Like the video, share it, and then go to the Telegram group a good number of rights ups on how to avoid scam crypto currencies i won't make the video so long but i will quickly take you to my uh, l bank account to show that 
this Suzuki Inu has been unlisted. You can no longer trade those who are holding this token in Suzuki Inu. In, uh, in uh, this token Suzuki Inu in L Bank, they are unable to sell it as we speak. I'm not sure they are going to list it again. Though the guys are pretending on some of their Telegram groups that they are coming back, but the, their Twitter. Uh, account has already been closed their telegram groups to which i belong to some of them were actually uh, that, that is they were no longer opened they were muted and nobody can write anything if if not of time constraint i will have taken you to the telegram groups you actually watch for yourself so please before you hold any coin especially the meme coins make sure you carry out enough investigation carry out enough research and I always help you through my videos, through my Telegram group on how to get the right coins and how to carry out your own research, how to do your own research. There are a lot of scammers out there uh, using cryptocurrencies. Remember, most of the Ponzi schemes have been abandoned. Nobody no goes into Ponzi schemes any longer and they have turned to uh, cryptocurrencies. They put up almost... 150 every day and remember it is a domain that the control is still very very difficult and so any type of jack and jill can put up a token and in a few weeks they scam and they move away but if you join this channel if you join the crypto uh, educa educative uh, uh, telegram group you are going to actually learn a lot join the telegram group it is called the media motivator and you are going to actually enjoy beautiful information as far as cryptocurrency is concerned if you are watching the channel for the first time please don't forget to do yourself a favor by subscribing enabling the notification bell sharing and liking the video make sure you like the video bye for now